Okay, so magandang hapon po sa ating lahat. So, ayan. So, uh, ang gagawin po natin for today is uh, we have to find the mean, median, mode ng uh, group data. Okay, so may example na po, uh, may table na po tayo rito. So, last time is nag-construct uh, na po tayo ng distri uh, frequency distribution table doon sa ating ano, unang ginawa. Okay, now, now naman is how to find the mean, the median, and then the mode. Okay, so unang gagawin is we have to complete this table. Okay, so nakaayos na po yung ating class interval We have the frequency And then uh, less than commutative uh, frequency So tinuro ko na po sa inyo kung paano kinukuha Okay, so kung nakalimutan So tandaan nyo lang tayo At tandaan nyo lang is pasigsag po tayo So 3, so lagay lang po natin And then 3 plus 10 we have 13 13 plus 6 we have 19 19 plus 8, we have 27. 27 plus 6, we have 33. 33 plus 14, we have 47. 47 plus 3, we have 50. 50 plus 3, we have 53. 53 plus 4, this one. So, we have 57. 57 plus 3, we have 60. Okay? So, ang total natin. And, and then, para naman po makuha si lower boundary. Okay? So, tingin lang po tayo dito sa ating uh, lower limit. So, minus 0.5. Okay? So, 28. So, we have 27.5. And then, hanggang baba po. Okay? Para naman po makuha si class mark. So, class mark, we just only add yung ating class interval. So, we have 28 plus 29. Then, divide by 2. Okay? So, pag nakuha na to, so, minus 2, minus 2. Kasi ang 2 is yung interval po natin. Para mas mabilis. Okay? So, ayan. And then, para naman makuha si FX. Para sa pagkuha po ni Min. So, ayan po. So, ang gagawin lang is we have to multiply the frequency. And then, we have 3 times 28.5. So, we have 85.5. Okay? And then, unang-una. So, kunin po natin si summation of FX. Ibig sabihin yung total po nito. Okay, so add lang po natin lahat. So ingat po sa pag-add uh, po ha. Kasi kapag nagkamali po ng isa, so lahat po yan is uh, magkakamali na po. Okay, so ayan. So we have summation of FX is uh, 1,000, uh, 1,106. Okay, now sa so pagkuha po muna na ano, ni min. Okay, so pag min po is we have, ito po yung formula ni min. So, we have, ayan, x bar is equal to summation of fx all over n. So, ayan. Okay? So, meron na po tayong n, which is uh, 60. And then, we have the summation of fx. So, we have 11, uh, 06, or 1,106. So, substitute lang po natin yan. So, we have 1106 divided by 60. So, ang ating mean is uh, we have 18.43 so ayan okay so pagkuha po ni min so ayan okay na po so again punan dito so punta naman po tayo kay median okay next natin will be how to find the uh, median okay so formula ng median we have the x yung sa taas will be uh, tilde yung parang bigote okay is equal to uh, lower bound plus the quantity n over 2 minus less than cumulative frequency all over uh, frequency times the i i is the interval okay so meron na po tayo ron i so ang ang unang gagawin po ninyo is uh, kunin po muna natin si n over 2 Okay, n over 2. So, ayan. Ito po yung unang uh, kukunin po natin para malaman po natin kung anong gagamitin natin sa lower bound saka sa frequency. Okay, so divide lang po natin to. So, ang n po natin is 60. Divide by 2. So, this is 30. Okay. So, yung 30 natin, uh, balikan po natin yung table. Okay, so dun sa uh, less than frequency, uh, cumulative frequency, so... 
hanapin po natin kung mayroon 30. So, kapag wala, yung higher, yung mataas po ron. Okay? So, ang uh, pwede natin gamitin will be this one. Okay? So, lagyan po natin ng ano, katulad ng ginawa natin last time para alam po natin kung ano yung gagamitin po natin. So, ayan. Okay? So, yung may guhit po. So, ang kukunin po natin para sa lower uh, lower boundary. So, ayan. Meron natin po tayong lower boundary is this one. So, ilagay po natin lahat ng given. So, ang ating lower boundary will be 17.5. So, ayan. And then, uh, ang ating less than commutative frequency. So, ito po yung ating 33. So, ang kukunin po natin yung nasa baba po this one. Okay? So, we have 27. Okay? Next one, so ang ating frequency, ang frequency natin, yung ginuhitan po natin, so ito po, yung 6 po ang ating frequency. So, ayan. So, ano pa ba? So, ang I po natin, so nandyan na po yung ating I, I is 2. Okay? So, ayan. So, pwede na po natin siyang substitute. Okay? So, lagay po natin dito. We have the formula. Okay. So, ang ating lower boundary is 17.5 plus. Ang N over 2 po natin ay yung nakuha natin kanina is 30. So, minus 27 all over uh, 6. So, ayan. Okay. And then, times 2. Ayan. So, we have here uh, 17 point five plus so we have uh, yung nasa loob will be uh, 3 over 6 times 2 so kapag kinumpute uh, po natin yan so that will be plus 1 okay so 2 times 3 so that is 6 so 6 over 6 is 1 so ang ating median will be so 17 point five plus 1 so, this become 18.5. So, ayan. Okay? Ayan po ang ating median. Okay, next one. Next po natin is ang mode. Mode po na tayo, ha? So, ang formula po ng mode, uh, we have x. So, yung guhit na pataas that is hot is equal to lower bound plus d1 or the quantity d1 all over d2 plus d1 times the i. Okay, yung D1, so ang una mo nating hahanapin is yung uh, pinakamataas na frequency. So, ang pinakamataas na frequency will be 14. Okay? So, uh, kunin po muna natin. So, this is D1 po natin ha. So, kunin po natin yung pinakamataas na frequency which is 14. So, ayan. Tapos, uh, isusubtract po natin yung nasa baba. Okay? So, before siya and then pag dito is after naman po. Okay. So, 14 minus 6. So, ang D1 po natin ay 8. For D2 naman, so we have 14 minus 3. Okay. So, ayan. So, this one. Ito po at saka ito. Okay. So, yung nasa baba will be D1. Yung nasa taas will be D2. So, this is D2 will be 11. Okay. And then, substitute na natin yung formula. So, Kanina, di ba, kinuha po natin yung pinakamataas na frequency. So, para makuha naman po si lower bound. So, again, ito po yung ating pinakamataas. So, ito po yung ating magiging lower bound. Si, ano, 19.5. Okay? So, ilagay po natin dito. Lower bound is 19.5. Okay? Sir, saan nakuha? Uh, check nyo lang po yung pinakamataas na frequency. So, guhit lang po. Okay? So, ayan. So, substitute na po natin lahat. So, we have uh, the mode. Ayan. Is equal to 19.5 plus ang D1 po natin is 8 all over 11 plus 8 times 2. Okay? So, ayan. So, we have 19.5 plus so 8 all over 19 times 2. Okay? And then, we have 19.5 plus, so divide po natin to, then times 2, and then 0.84. Okay? And then, add na, add na po natin siya. So, that will be 
20.34 So, ito na po ang ating mode So, ayan So, sana meron po kayong natutunan Sa pagkuha ni min, median, and then mode So, maraming pong salamat